Right, so what is going on guys, Jordan here. Welcome to Faces Back to a brand new video. Guys, today I need to talk to you about something. Uh, okay, so a couple of days ago, it was on Friday, I was meant to be recording a trampolining video, okay? So me uh, and my four mates all went to this indoor trampolining place. Um, obviously, if you've watched Nade Shop before, he got, he's been going to these trampoline, like, indoor uh, park sort of things. And there was obviously trampolines, there's foam pits, there's basketball, football, all this sort of stuff. And there's one that literally just opened about a month ago um, in Ipswich, about 30 minutes away from me, okay, about 30 minutes away. And we decided to go on that Friday and I was going to get a full recording of it. Um, I was going to record everything, do some flips, show you guys what I can do and all that sort of stuff, but it didn't really work. Uh, we wasn't, well, we were allowed to, like, take our phones with us, but I didn't want to get it damaged because I was, even though people could have held it for me, I, I filmed a couple of stuff, but then I thought there's not really much to actually film, so I just left it, and plus, uh, I kind of injured myself, guys, like, kind of bad. Okay, so, in this whole uh, indoor trampoline place, uh, it's called Flux, okay, so inside Flux, um, there's multiple trampolines all in the middle, okay, there's like about 50, no, not even 50, about 20, sorry, I don't even know why I'm over exaggerating, but about 20 trampolines, they're not even that big to be fair, like, they are really, really small, they're like, they're just a little square really, which obviously you can, you have enough space to bounce on a couple of times, maybe even flip or whatever, but, uh, it, it kinda, kinda went wrong like really bad man okay so there was this massive green beam okay this massive green like uh, I would say rectangle in the middle of it and people that were working there were saying to people that like looked good and um, that could do obviously multiple stuff and jump good and do all these sort of cool tricks to give it a go and they asked me and a couple of my friends they was like yo you actually seem like you know how to do it like how to do stuff on a trampoline why didn't you try to clear this? And I'm and when I'm saying it's big, guys, this this rectangle where you can jump and flip on or flip off, it is really, really long. Okay, like super long. Uh, if you haven't seen it, but it's basically my trampoline in the back garden, like the, the like the width for that, and the, it, it is just so so long. Okay, it's so so long. And he was telling me, yo yo yo, just try try clear it if you can. I've done it uh, once. And then before we went, because we only went there for an hour, we uh, it costs like ten pound uh, for an hour each time. But man, oh, it went it went so wrong, and literally I really really damaged my back. Okay, so it was about four to five minutes left of our time, and then we had to go. Okay, so he was like, everyone, obviously, like all of our me and my mates, he was like, yo, you guys, just quickly have one more go or something. So I was like, all right, I'll try to do it before I go because I wanted to make it look good, man. I wanted to make, I wanted to feel proud because obviously it's very hard to do it. Not a lot of people could actually do it. And this guy had a lot of confidence in me and said, you actually are really good at trampoline and all this sort of stuff. So I was obviously getting quite like ready for this. And when I was approaching, because the, there's obviously a trampoline which you have to bounce on to then jump over it, I was literally about like, Say this is the platform, I was literally, I bounced, and as soon as I bounced, like, my back clicked, for some reason, like, my spine, like, clicked in, like, multiple, multiple places in my back, and I got wounded straight away, it felt like, literally, I've been punched in the stomach, like, really bad, like, by someone really, really hard, and I literally, like, as soon as, like, as soon as I jumped, so, like, I jumped, and then as soon as I jumped, I got I felt wounded and I smacked I smacked like the, the green beam and then I like fell onto the other trampoline. And it was really, really hard for me to breathe, right? It was really hard for me to breathe. I didn't know what to do. Um, I was quite scared, but I didn't want to show how scared I was in front of everyone, so I tried to act cool. I just sat down for a minute and like just holding my chest and my stomach and everyone's like, you're right, I'm like, yeah, I'm good, I'm good, let's carry on. So they carried on for the last couple of minutes and I like got back into the car when we was about to go like home and I felt something on my back and I was like wow what is this and this lump was like on my back and I was like oh okay maybe it's just because obviously this just happened but uh, it's got really bad now like the lump's gone but my back is literally just dead I literally um, I have to like literally sit up to sleep I can't lay down I have to keep taking these tablets every like three to four hours um, a day it is very bad. It's very hard for me now just to sit like this. I literally have to like, if you can kind of, I just have to lay like this because I have to have pressure on my back. Otherwise it really, really aches. It's really hard for me to move around. And 
yeah, I might actually have to go to the hospital and try to get it clipped or something might be like out of place, I do not know. But something on my back is seriously giving me some trouble and I'm kind of scared because obviously I start my new job in the week and if it doesn't get like, you know, if it doesn't get better or it doesn't get fixed, I'm not going to be able to lift a lot of stuff because as you guys know, I'm going to be doing late, uh, late night work and I'm going to be lifting stuff to put into shelves and all that. And it's going to be kind of hard for me to get back down and then get back up again and down for multiple hours. And I just thought I should address this on my YouTube channel because a lot of people in the comments, well, on uh, Twitter that were replying to me were saying, are you alright and all this sort of stuff. And I just wanted to clear it up and let you guys know that I could possibly be going to hospital. I'm not too sure if I am. But it would be it like be an awful lot of help and it mean a lot if you could just like leave some support in the comment section below. It might make me feel a bit more happy because... I haven't really been able to do anything but just stay here in my bedroom, like I haven't been able to do anything um, but it's seriously hurting man, it's seriously hurting. I don't want to make this video like to be all depressing and upsetting but honestly I just thought, you know, you, you guys are like my family so I want to address you and tell you what's been going on. So yeah, that's basically it but I'm seriously injured, I don't know what I should do, like it is seriously, seriously bad. I wish I had a video to show you of what happened but it felt like Wayne Johnson had like literally this grabbed my head and punched me in the stomach. Oh my god. I just... Whew, I felt like I was going to be sick, man. It was horrible. But guys, I just thought I should clear that up. So thank you to everyone that has tuned in and watched this video. Sorry if it's been very boring, but a lot of you guys wanted to see it over Twitter and I thought I should do it for people that haven't seen it over Twitter, but you need to be addressed. So, hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, hit that like button. Also, subscribe if you're new. And one more thing, uh, I'm obviously not going to be doing an awful lot of activities around the next couple of days because obviously I need to give this some rest. And literally after this, I'm just going to chill out uh, grab a drink and just sit here and watch some movies or something because that's all I can that's all I've been doing all day man It's horrible, but that's about it. So I hope you guys have enjoyed and uh, It's been your boy Jody. Remember stay awesome be yourself once again, and I'll see you guys in the next video Peace